Welcome back to M. Ratthitch channel, the best place to learn table tennis. The video has the subtitle. Please turn on captioning for better understanding. Hi, how are you? Welcome back to Ping Sunday. Many players ask me the same question. Is it allowed to throw the racket in table tennis? Here's the rule about the legal strike in table tennis. Strike two, 5.7. A player strikes the ball if he touches it in play with his racket held in the hand or with his racket hand below the wrist. Unfortunately, this is not a good shot. The racket must be in your hand when you hit the ball. The racket must be in your hand when you hit the ball. No, 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 no. Is it permissible to throw the racket into the ball in table tennis? No. If you throw your racket into the ball, you lose the point. A player may not throw the racket at the ball with the intention of hitting it. The ball must be struck by a racket held in your racket hand. Therefore, if you drop the racket, you no longer have control over a racket hand. Your hand must remain on the playing surface at all times. What happens if I drop my racket after hitting the ball? When a player strikes the ball, it's essential to have full control over their racket. This entails refraining from intentionally dropping or throwing the racket to make contact with the ball. If the ball touches a dropped or thrown racket, the player loses the point. However, if a player unintentionally drops their racket after hitting the ball, assuming the racket doesn't hit the net, net post, or the opponent's side, the ball remains in play. If the player is able, they can retrieve the racket and continue the point. Conversely, if a thrown racket hits the net, net post, or crosses over the net and lands on the opponent's side, the opponent scores the point. Can I continue to play when I drop my racket? Yes, after hitting the ball, and then you drop your racket. It's legal to pick up your racket and continue to play. In this case, Fan Zhendong has dropped his racket after hitting the ball, so it's legal. A player is prohibited from throwing the racket at the ball in an attempt to make contact. If a player accidentally drops their racket, they must retrieve it before attempting to hit the ball. The ball must be struck using a racket that is held in your racket hand. Consequently, if you happen to drop the racket, you lose your ability to employ the racket hand. A player must maintain control of their racket when striking the ball. This implies that a player cannot intentionally drop or throw the racket in order to hit the ball. If the ball makes contact with a racket that has been dropped or thrown, the player forfeits the point. It is not allowed for a player to intentionally drop or throw their racket, such as to hit a ball. Read more about table tennis on my blog, pingsunday.com. Get free ebook and coaching advices. See you in the next video.